One of my people, Luis Arraez, decided to explain us the reason why he does the drill that we talked in a few videos ago. Let's show let's show the drill that he was doing. So Luis Arraez does this drill, and we do a video about him doing the drill, and we explain that yeah, that's good for your hands, that's good for your turn, that's good because you got the ball that deep and high that allow that that allow you to turn the barrel around the rip. I mean, on the form, on the form, connect it. So it's kind of good in that aspect. And then I say, uh, the bagley is not turning. So you have to watch out when you do this drill without the bagley, because a lot of kids like to push the hands too much and they don't use in the bagley that well. But obviously when you got a MLB player, like Luis Arise, you, you have a guy that control his body very really well. But then, uh, what else I say? I say something else. And you say that you, oh, you say you kind of, you were not agree too much with the drill of just the hands. Just the hands because they make you push. Yes. Yeah. So I say that and because we real and you have to put your observation as a coach, not like a, ah, I like, like everybody, you no. like me. No, and no, no. We're not like that. That's not Castro. No, both. this is just analyzing. That's all about, uh, we had to bring proof to y'all and you, and you, um, we can, we can talk and debate or whatever. And then you go with your own conclusions to you be a better player every day, or you better coach or whatever. And you exactly. like, whatever, because you cannot go with the, ah, but Albert Pujols, uh, do this drill. So I do it. Okay. Albert Pujols used to throw the knob to the ball and then he don't do it. So I was not about that. I don't like it. I do it. I did it all the time, but I'm about to turn the barrel like here. I'm about to, I like it. I like that. So. It's not about throwing hate on nobody, and it's about just bringing the uh, more solid conclusion and more uh, close to where we want to be, like yeah. elite, right? So, and I take his time and explain us after I say that, and we say that, and I take his time to explain us. And it was a real. It was we took a a, bit, a short video from YouTube, from the YouTube video, and we put it on Instagram, and arrived. So, and he decided to comment and make his explanation he's he's over there in your screen it's in spanish but we're gonna translate that real quick okay so all right say saludos my saludos mis brothers hi my brothers ese drill es de calentamiento that drill is for is to warm up además era mi primera práctica plus it was my first first practice, practice. can you translate that for me okay please? Y este drill me ha ayudado mucho and that, a controlar. And that drill helped me to control a lot. Um, no, it's a, a control the to con upper body. To control his upper body, yeah. Si te pones a ver los demás drill. If you go see the other drills that I do. Yo comienzo a girar. Y I, con, mm -hmm. I start to turn. Y comienzo a utilizar mis piernas. And, and, and start using my legs. Para todos los que lean este mensaje, for everybody that read this message, confíen en sus manos, trust their, their hands, dejen de estar pensando en tanto movimiento a la hora de batear, don't think about moving too much in the time of hitting, vayan y disfruten del juego, go have fun and playing the game, y metan mano, and work hard. Eso sí, nunca, eso sí, nunca se pongan cómodos. And never get too comfortable. Sigan trabajando duro. Keep working hard. Bendiciones, hermano. God bless you all, Feliz brothers. Navidad. Happy, uh, uh, Merry Christmas. Mucha vida. A lot of life. Y salud and para health. todos. Bendiciones. God bless you, whatever. Venezuela and Puerto Rico. Desde Flax already. Right uh, Puerto Por Rico and Venezuela. I love whatever. And... That's that's my yeah, translation. He, he don't he say whatever. Very, I just trying to translate. Very political, very friendly yeah, with very the message. Good. You know, he wanted to make sure the message was clear. Clear. Exactly. Now, uh, this is good because you come with the conclusion that he take his time to explain to us, explain everybody that watching that drill because yeah. a lot of kids want to do what Arise is doing because you're talking about Arise, you're thinking about the the one champion hit what is that champion hitter right he got slugger, titles silver hitting. slugger two times yeah in a in row hitting so he was the one of the most consistent maybe the one the most consistent hitting hitter 
in the MLB in two leagues in in the American and national. So he know how to he 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 got something right. Okay. So obviously the kids doing this drill. I was explaining about the back leg had to turn because in reality you had to bring the back leg. The back leg will bring the hands. The hands don't even move. The back leg is already turning before the hands start moving forward. But you see, if you think about it, what made him come in and do his explanation was the point that we you say or we say that we don't agree with not using just with using just the hands in the drill. Uh -huh. And he gave his explanation, and, and I'm that, still thinking like that. Yeah, and, and, and that's why he explained is it was a progression. So yeah. he do the upper body, but then he had to go with the lower body in some point. And then you have to put it together. The problem is with the kids, they don't, they, they, I had a lot of problems with kids just not, not turning the back leg. They bring in the hands before they're turning the back leg and they're using their chest and they don't turn in their wrist and they don't doing all this stuff that he do in reality. You get what I'm saying? So not because I rise doing that kind of drill, that means he's going to, Oh, magically, everything's gonna mm -hmm. happen. It may it worked for him. Maybe he clicked something for him. He clicked something because he, he seemed like a, he say he, he feel more control. Exactly. He feel probably more connected because he literally what he's doing this drill is just get creating good connection right uh -huh. here when he turned. But he does it right. But may, watch out when he say, uh, "Your hands. Think about your hands. Think about uh -huh. your hands. Yeah, Use your hands." That. He say, think about your hands, and there's it can be problems with that too. That's the way of him thinking. But like reality, the hands is not the one they're hitting. No. In reality, the back leg, if you can see it, right here's the proof. I don't, I don't freaking lie. I don't freaking just because I know right now you listen to me, and then you're probably thinking like, who you play? Where? Our eyes telling you, dude. It's been a lot of legends been telling us how to hit, and they're sometimes they're not right. But the thing is, that's his, that's their feeling. That's what they think. That's what they feel. But what they really happening, you can see it. The back leg is already turning, but the hands didn't move. So that tells you back leg is what bring the speed on the hands. Mm -hmm. Okay. When you go too handsy and your hands just hands and don't use your back leg right, then you're going to push and then yeah. you're going to be slow and you're going to be uh, not consistent. Your barrels aren't going to get on time. Okay. So. His cue is his hands. Yeah. But his back is working. Okay. So watch out. So make sure you, you probably can do the drill, what he's doing, go with the progression of what he's planning. But when you watch the video and you go to hit, I need to see this or I know me, anybody, not just me. Now, if you want to be a lead, you have to make sure that you bring the right sequence. Oh, shoot. Right. If you bring the right sequence. Maybe you're in the right page. It doesn't matter what you think. It doesn't matter what you believe. It doesn't matter what you what you work. But in the time of work, in the time of, of hitting the reality, you have to look like this. Yes. Okay. So, and the and the hitting coach says something. The hitting coach. You want to read it or yeah, not? I read it. All right. Yeah, we go short right here. So, the hitting coach that where he's working right there in that facility say, "Los Castro Bros, buenas noches, saludos." So, Castro Bros, uh, good night. Uh, how you doing? Something like that. Yeah. Soy de los coach que siempre ha aplicado en mis prácticas con los atletas dividir la parte superior y la parte inferior. I'm one of those coaches that I divide upper body with lower body. Y es por ello... In practice. Uh -huh. and, it, and, and, and it's for that reason. En ese video solo se ve a Luis Arraez utilizando la parte de arriba. And that reason, and Luis Arraez looked like he just using the upper body. That's why the video looked like that. Estos ejercicios de calentamiento. This uh, exercise of warming up. Son algunas de las técnicas que hemos utilizado. Was some of uh, techniques that we use. Para obtener los resultados que han hecho historia. To, up, uh, obtain. to, get, to get the results that we, we make history. Two títulos de bateo. Two titles of hitting. Okay, bruto. I say two titles de bateo. Dos titles de bateo. Two titles of, of, of hitting, like silver slugger. Uh -huh. Y dos and, silver slugger. Oh, two titles of hitting and then silver slugger. I don't know. Whatever. En just, dos años consecutivos. And two years in a row. So, obviously, the coach is just trying to prove that that drill work. Mm -hmm. And he tried to just say as a... 
the proof is there. Yeah. Okay. And then, and we don't say nothing wrong well, about that. No. I think and, you have to yeah. be proud of what you're teaching and be, uh, uh, you know, uh, this is what I believe and whatever. And we never say that on work. Never. But the we problem is the fans, because we, we, we giving our point and we're telling you, Hey, that this don't work probably for these people, for this, for this, for this. And they think they in the head, I don't know what they're hearing. It's just, we're talking bad about them. We yeah. criticizing the major league. We criticizing their career. God dang it! Pay they attention get, to what we say, man. They get too defensive. But yes. Maybe this is more as a Latino area. That's it's in the more Latino like area. More yeah. defensive, but and I don't know. I don't know. In English, it's more like it's a little different. Yeah, in English, but, we they they more honest. They're like, yeah. if you don't work, don't work. Yeah. You're right. I agree with you, but. Hispanic people, we like to be fans. Yeah. We protect fan. our players. Yeah, protect our players. Yeah. We forget about just the logic behind everything, right? Use just your like, logic. Just like uh, they do this drill, and a lot of people, they're thinking like, that drill, that's crazy. Dude, it's some kind of way working. Yeah. But that don't mean they're going to work for you because in literally, you don't going to hit with just your hands. It's no. not going to work. It's not going to happen. So it's an idea of something, a progressional doing like uh okay upper body maybe lower body i don't have to like it i don't have to do it like them no nope. because i I'm, i got my opinions on things i think his mechanics on the game is good. they're good yeah so i'm focused more on that i don't focus on just in the way of they working because that's just different because if if, if it's just the way they're working it's probably gonna be uh, all the hitters that go there, they're going to be like, ooh, you know what I mean? It's not, it's not going to happen. It's just more about look for the video, and then I will want to copy, duplicate, duplicate Luis Arraes' yep. swing in some of my kids. Yep. That's what we're teaching, you know, because there's plenty of people doing that drill, and I know people that do go over there and they do the drill, but it's not about that. It's just about like, okay, the full body is moving well. The full body is moving like a Luis Arraes. Luis Arraes like that drill, because he can ask his body accept it right. His yeah. body is like, okay, I feel good with doing this real, but whenever I go to the game, everything work out together. Yeah. Okay. So make sure your body's working the right way. Even you're doing this real with your hands, and even you're thinking with your hands, even you're thinking with your butt, even you're thinking with your nose. I don't care. But let's be honest. We have to do right in those videos. When those videos look right in the game on the BP or whatever. We may be doing something right. When you're just throwing your hands and not throwing your back leg and you, everything's out of sequence. Awful. Awful. No, it doesn't matter. That drill is not going to fix it. Okay? That drill is just it's just hands, right? But it maybe can help you to stay connected or little things here and there. Yep. Okay? My people, so. thank you for watching. Like always, thank you for the support. We Woo! We are. We'll see you on the next video. See you. I know that video with Lisa Rye, huh? Yeah. One little video, huh? Oh, yeah. It would be great.